75% of Americans already have access. It's Iowa's turn. It has become a familiar sight at the Capitol. My son is a patient and I am not a criminal. I am just a mom following doctor's orders. Parents who want their children to have the option of medical cannabis and legislators urging their peers. I will work hard in the next two to three to four weeks before we adjourn to make sure we get a bill out and on the House floor for debate. The bill has not been signed. The Republican who introduced it doesn't know if it will even make it out of committee. I want people who are opponents of this to become advocates for it. Iowa City Senator Joe Bolcom says the pared down medical cannabis bill needs more distribution centers and more eligible medical conditions. The House bill uh, was gutted uh, uh, right after it was uh, introduced and it will hardly help any Iowan. So it's a bill that's probably not worth passing unless it can be greatly improved upon. Bolcom says virtually every Democrat in the Iowa House is ready to support a comprehensive medical marijuana program. And in order to get to 51 votes, they'll need about eight or nine Republicans to join them to, to basically pass a bill. And that's a big, that's a tall order for those Republicans to, to break ranks with their, uh, their speaker. Monday night, the Windsor Heights City Council approved a resolution asking state legislators to pass a new medical cannabis bill and they sent requests to every mayor, city council, and county supervisor across the state this week, asking them to do the same. We want the legislators to do the right thing.